Jesus in the scriptures, really what he was, was a game changer who turned a death situation into one of a life possibility. I think that's what we most need in society today. We have too many people that are fitting in, going along, business as usual, status quo. And it's time to realize that although it takes a whole village to raise a child, the village is broken. And the village needs to be fixed. And if it's going to do that, it does not need business as usual or status quo. What we need in society today is game changers. And that's whether it's public officials, whether it's faith communities, whether it's ordinary citizens, or whether it's librarians or the library institution as a whole. We need game changers. We'll be lobbyists for the victims of our society that feel forgotten and abandoned. We need game changers who will use whatever influence and power they have to see what they can do to affect this thing that is taking our future from us. The interrupters of this violence, this procession of funeral, of death of our children, is snatching our babies from us. And to a large part, we've allowed it to continue in America and turned our backs because it primarily affected brown and black children. And it wasn't until Newtown, until America woke up to say, wow, what has happened? What's happening in our country? And suddenly we became aware, well, 506 children die in three years in Chicago, and it's not a national issue, but it happens in Connecticut, and we woke up. But you know what? Whatever makes us wake up, it's time to stay awake and not go back to sleep.